In this video, I'm going to replace the thumb throttle on my Saunders Mad Mods with a half twist throttle. I'm also going to replace the gear shifter, which is a twist uh, selector, to a trigger selector. One of the benefits to that is it's a much more compact design, which will move the brake lever outboard, which is nice because right now it's kind of a reach for that uh, brake lever. So that's one of the benefits. All the products used are linked in the description below. So please subscribe to my channel. So let's get started. Before I start disassembling anything, I'm gonna make sure that the gear selector is in seventh gear. The smallest gear back here. That way when I install the new gear selector, it will be in the same gear. Pull off the end cap. I use these pliers and you wanna leave the cable housing because then you can feed the new cable through the housing and it'll be super easy. So one thing I found out is this shifter cable that came with this seven speed shifter is six inches too short. So I guess what I would do is, and reuse the one that came with the bike with the new shifter. You can easily slide that out like that. Now, before I lock down the brake location and the shifter, I'm gonna install the new throttle. Now, the key is you gotta remember the, thr the new throttle is a half twist and you don't want the grip pinching it. So it comes with this spacer. It has a little top hat or brim on it. So what you wanna do is install that on like such, then the spacer, which prevents the throttle from getting pinched, and then this grip. But in order to get the grip to slide on, you can kind of manhandle it on there. Or what I like to do is put a little bit of soap on there, lube it up like such, and then what you're gonna do is then it will help slide on there a little bit easier. Now that I slid the grip onto the end of the handlebar, I got this placed and I'll see how I want it. And then what I'm gonna do is attach this cable, line up the tab, and I'm gonna install that like such. Now I'm gonna figure out how I want this located and I'm gonna secure all these bolts and get it aligned how I want it to get it properly located. Now after feeding the brake cable through, I made sure the cable goes through that hole, locks in with that nut, and now that I'm happy with the gears, I'm gonna put the brake end cap back on. All right, after adjusting everything, I got everything mounted. I actually moved the brake outboard and then put the shifter inboard. That way it gives me a better reach to it and it fit everything a lot better. And the transmission uh, reaches over the brake hydraulic cylinder. I put the other matching grip on the other side, used a little bit of Dawn soap, slid right on. I actually had to move the brake and the controller remote outboard just a smidge, but I really like this setup. Now I'm gonna do a test ride. I really like the twist throttle. It's much easier to control. The gears are easier to adjust. The brake lever is easier to grab. Uh, the other thing I notice is it's much easier than the thumb throttle to regulate a speed, especially midway. So I hope you like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.